Today we are going to be showing you how to troubleshoot fault code 2211, FSW interlock tripped on your JLG boom lift. If your machine is encountering this fault the drive and steer functions are not operating from the platform control console, the JLG analyzer is showing a FSW interlock tripped code, and a DOS indicator is flashing on the platform console panel. Some possible causes for this fault are Main boom not positioned center between the rear wheels Malfunctioning drive orientation proximity switch Or an open circuit harness from proximity switch to ground control module Troubleshooting steps 1. Verify the black and white arrows on the drive joystick match the arrow decals on the chassis Black is the forward direction which requires the drive joystick to be pushed forward to drive forward. 2. If the directions do not match and space permits, swing the turntable 180 degrees to orient the machine properly. 3. If the space does not permit swinging the turntable, activate the DOS override switch located in front of the drive joystick on the platform control console. Then slowly activate the drive or steer function within 3 seconds to move the machine to an area to allow the machine to be placed into the transport position. 4. If the main boom is centered with the rear wheels and the DOS override switch has been activated to achieve movement, then verify the state of the drive orientation proximity switch located under the turntable near the top of the hydraulic swivel. 5. The open or closed state of the proximity switch can be viewed with the JLG analyzer. Go to the menu selection diagnostics slash drive steer slash drive orientation switch. It should read closed. 6. If the proximity switch is reading open, verify continuity of the proximity switch with a multimeter. If the proximity switch shows open, replace the proximity switch. If the proximity switch tested correctly, inspect the wiring harness from the proximity switch back to the ground control module for open circuits, refer to the drive orientation switch diagnostics attachment. Thanks for watching. You can find a detailed list of the troubleshooting steps linked down below in the description, and you can find all the parts and equipment used in this video over on our website gciron.com.